Monday morning, yes. Oh, Larry, <laughs> these, guys, <laughs> these guys are awake and ready to go. Look at him. Yeah. All right, see, these guys are me heading off to taking Vinny to the airport in Newark, New Jersey. Adam's taking him over to the airport and uh, off to Brazil. But you got to make a stop in Houston first, right? Yeah. Is it uh, Newark to Houston? Houston to, to Sao Paulo. San Paulo. All right, so we've got a quite quite a journey ahead of you yeah. today. Yeah. You got your uh, you got your official travel gear on. Yeah. Um, you ready to try to sleep with a mask on in the plane? No. <laughs> <laughs> so apparently you can only take your mask out if you're drinking or eating. But they don't tell they don't told me how long I have to be eating or drinking. Yeah, so, so just never stop eating. It's just like uh, 15 hours of eating. Yeah. <laughs> well, I'm just taking my next. Keep bite. a really long straw in your mouth. <laughs> <laughs> so, so that should be that should be interesting. Okay, so this chapter here is just one for endurance. So we're going through the descendants of Esau, and believe me, we're going to butcher these names right and left. But we're gonna we're gonna plow through it because this is a chapter you never read on your own. You would just yep. you just would like oh okay I see there's a bunch of names here. So we're we're gonna we're gonna plow through this and. Um, we won't have much to say about it afterwards. <laughs> I have a, yeah. I'll just have a couple things to say. We're going to discuss about life. We're going to discuss yep. life, right? why we should not name our kids after these <laughs> the, these names here. This is this is this is important. All right. So and, uh, we'll, I apologize because I'm coming back to Brazil and take the heat with me. So uh, sorry, yeah. guys. <laughs> yeah, we looked at the extended outlook, and the uh, temperatures are going to plunge plunge here yeah. uh, next week. We'll be going down in the 30s at night. I'm going to crawl it. into a carry-on, go to Brazil. <laughs> He's going to where it's 90 degrees or whatever. Or more. Or more. Well, that's all right. I don't know. I'm, I'm not a 90-degree <laughs> person. All right. So we've got the sun shining on us here, Sean. So it's, it's nice. So Vinny's going to start us off. Vinicius. We're going to give him the real, the, uh, the uh, full name. We're about names the, today. <laughs> all right. Go um, for it. And sorry for my Portuguese versions of the names. <laughs> <laughs> so chapter 36, Esau descended. This is the account of Esau. Esau took his wives from the women of Canaan, Adam, daughter of Elam the Hittite, and Oholabama, daughter of Anna, and granddaughter of Zebion the, the Havite, also Basemath, daughter of Ishmael, and sister of ne Nebaioth. Ada bore Eliphaz to Esau, Bezmath bore Will, and Oholabama bore Jewish, Halem, Halam, and Korah. These were the sons of Esau, who were born to him in Canaan. Esau took his wives and sons and daughters and all the members of his household as well his livestock and all his other animals and all the goods he had acquired in Canaan and moved to a land some distance from his brother Jacob. Their possessions were too great for them to remain together. The land where they were staying could not support them both because of their livestock. So Esau settled in the hill country of Seir. This is the account of Esau, the father of the Ed Edomites and the hill country of Seir. These are the names of Esau's son, Eliphaz, the son of Esau's wife, Ada, and Rio, the son of Esau's wife, Basemath. The sons of Eliphaz, Tima, Omar, Zepho, Gadam, and Canaz. Esau's son, Eliphaz, also had a combined name, Tina, Tina who bore him Al Amlek. There, these were grandsons of Esau, wife Adam, the sons of Reel, Nah, Nahath, Zerah, Chama, and Mira. There were grandsons of Esau, wife Basemath, the sons of Esau's wife Oholabama, daughter of Anna, and granddaughter of Zebium, whom she bore to Esau, Jash, Jashua, Jish, Jalen, and Korah. <laughs> These were the chiefs among Esau's descendants, the sons of Eliphaz, the firstborn of Esau. Chiefs Teman, Omar, Zepho, Kenaz, Korah, Gatam, and Amalek. 
These were the chiefs descended from Eliphaz and Edom. They were grandsons of Ada, the sons of Esau's son, Reu. Chiefs Nehath, Zerah, Shammah, and Mizah. These were the chiefs descended from Reu and Edom. They were grandsons of Esau's wife, Bezmath. The sons of Esau's wife, Aholabama, chiefs Jehush, Jalam, and Korah. These were the chiefs descended from Esau's wife, Aholabama, daughter of Anna. These were the sons of Esau, that is Edom, and these were their chiefs. These were the sons of Seir, the Hor Horite, who were living in the region. Lotan, Shobal, Zibion, Anna, Deshan, Ezer, and Deshan. These sons of Seir and Edom were Horite chiefs. The sons of Lotan, Hori, and Homan, Timnal was Lotan's sister. The sons of Shobal, Alvan, Manahath, Ebal, Sepho, and Onam. The sons of Zibion, Aya and Anna. This is the Anna who discovered the hot springs in the desert while he was grazing the donkeys of his father Zibion. The children of Anna, Deshan and Oholabama, daughter of Anna. The sons of Deshan, Hemdan, Eshban, Ithran, and Keran. The sons of Ezer, Bilhan, Zavan, and Akan. The sons of Deshan, Uz, and Iran. These were the Horite chiefs, Lotan, Shobal, Zibion, Anna, Deshan, Ezer, and Deshan. These were the Horite chiefs according to their divisions in the land of Seir. Verse 31. <clears throat> These were the kings who reigned in Edom before any Israelite king reigned. Bela, son of Beor, became king of Edom. His city was named Dinahaba. When Bela died, Jobab, son of Zerah, from Bozrah, uh, to succeed in him as king. When Jacob died, Husham, from the land of the Temanites, succeeded him as king. When Husham died, Hadad, son of Bedad, who defeated Midian in the country of Moab, succeeded him as king. His city was named Avith. When Hadad died, Samla from Masreka succeeded him as king. When Samla died, Shaol from Rehoboth on the river succeeded him as king. When Shaol died, Baal Hanan, uh, son of Akbar, succeeded him as king. When Baal Hanan, son of Akbar, died, Hadad succeeded him as king. His city was named Paul, and his wife's name was Mehetabal, daughter of Matrid, the daughter of Mizahab. These are the chief descendants from Esau by name, according to their clans and regions. Timnah, Ava, Jetha, Jetheth, Oholabama, Elah, Pinyon, Kenaz, Teman, Mibzar, Magdiel, and Iram. These were the chiefs of Edom according to their settlements in the land they occupied. This was Esau, the father of the Edomites. All right, let's pray. Father, we come into your presence and are thankful uh, for your word, even parts of the Bible that we, you know, we would tend to skip over and and um, find difficult to understand what its meaning and purpose is for our, our lives now. But we ask, Lord God, you would give us insight into what you would teach us now. We praise in Jesus' name. So I just have a couple, just a couple comments on this. Uh, you know, when you get to a section like this, it's, it's like, wh why? You know, <laughs> why? Uh, but I think the closest thing I can see is that for Rachel and Isaac's sake, you know, you have Jacob and Esau, the twins that are born. Jacob, that's the blessing. That's who the, the line of the Messiah is going to come through. But Esau, for Rachel and Isaac's sake, is going to have a kingdom. And so they're showing that, yes, Esau is Esau's descendants do have a kingdom they, they they grow and they're prosperous as a as a people and so that's one thing that that uh i i kind of take away from this that okay you got to go through all these names but it is showing the bible is history and this is what's going on um that esau forms the kingdom of edom the edomites uh who will later fracture into to um you know, you'll see that in the prophets and so forth. Talk about the Edomites. Mm -hmm. So that's that's this is their uh, origin there, and then also there's a um, a prophetic statement in verse 31 
these were the kings who reigned in Edom before any Israelite king reigned. So this is written um, by Moses, is, is, sub, is the author of the first five books of the Bible. It's revealed to him these things, so he would have to be prophetically revealed uh, way before there's any king that, in, in Israel. And then the, uh, the other thing is, um, in verse 2, Esau took wives from women of Canaan, Ada, daughter of Elon the Hittite, and Aholabama, daughter of Anna, and the granddaughter of Zibion the Hittite, also Basemith, daughter of Ishmael, the sister of Nebeth. So that, those wives are, are different than um, the wives that uh, were laid out, that um, were spoken of in chapter 26, verse 34. Uh, and there's a couple theories on, on what's going on here. Uh, could have been that his original wives died, he has other wives. These could be nicknames, or in one case they're nicknames one place and there's different names here. Uh, there is a possibility that there, there is uh, some transmission issue uh, in regards to that. So there's a couple theories. We don't know exactly why the names are a little bit different um, in this verse than 26 uh, verse 26 chapter 26 verse 34 mm -hmm. okay so that's pretty much all I had to say about this <laughs> um, <laughs> I don't know I don't yeah. know uh, I, I like the little the little piece of information on verse 24 they just threw that out there this is Anna who discovered the hot springs in the desert yeah. while he was grazing the donkeys all right that's a good thing that's a good <laughs> I don't know if I'd want a hot spring I want a cold spring in the desert not a hot spring in the desert. Well, starting yeah. next week, I'll take the hot spring in the desert. <laughs> hot spring in the desert. Right. It depends. The nights in the desert can be cold. They can be true. cold. It lo it, they lose, uh, especially more of uh, I, some of the Middle Eastern desert. Occasionally it snows even in like Jordan and other yeah. places. Oh, that's an, uh, one other thing. Edom it was located uh, south and east of the Dead Sea uh, in modern day Jordan, I think it would mostly be. That was the kingdom of Eden, so modern day Jordan. Mm -hmm. But occasionally it does snow in the desert. And and these are like a, more a little bit further north desert, so it can get chilly at yeah, night. Yeah, there's beautiful pictures of snow in the desert. Yeah. yeah. So very interesting. We we plowed through the name. So yeah. um, <clears throat> we wanna today we wanna lift up uh, Vin Vinicius as he's <laughs> heading out back to Brazil and blessings upon him uh as he as he travels do i need to go to my descendants or like uh, yeah my parents could, grandparents uh, like we until could, yes. now yeah nope. could, could. how far back can you go you might be a descendant of a whole obama <laughs> <laughs> we don't know we don't know we, don't. Yeah. <laughs> we were wondering if obama if uh, obama was a, a descendant of a whole obama yep Gotta probably be. not Gotta be. <laughs> there, so Let's uh, let's pray for let's pray for Vinicius. Father, we come in your presence and we're thankful for just the time that we've had uh, with Vinny. Uh, we pray for your blessing to be upon him as he travels. Watch over him, keep him in your care. May he bring the light and hope of Jesus with him to Brazil, uh, bring him safe travels. Just a great uh, reunion with his girlfriend, with his. Um, family there and uh, that your hand of blessing would be upon him continue to lead him and guide him and that the hope and love of jesus would go with him we pray this in jesus mighty name amen amen, amen. bless you all right thank you, you want to say anything you, everybody? Guys. Speak, no. a, speak a little portuguese to, to the yeah no. <laughs> just say thank you for all these devotions mornings it's been a pleasure to be here sometimes we just forget how important read the bible is so yeah, yeah. yeah this is a moment it's like 20 minutes 15 minutes per day so it's really important and i hope to continue watching yeah. and participating yeah. oh you can tune in from brazil i can turn in Stay from connected brazil. across the world thing. all right awesome take care all right, guys take care you.